definitely the dark horse. Like, he was just kind of a buzz, and it, you know everybody was wanting to see him. He came out in the preliminary. He really showed out pretty good, and it was really pretty awesome just the way that, that he blew up so fast right there. You know, he wasn't really very known. From birth, unbelievable how natural, talented he was just walking. A buddy of mine bought this horse over at Wiser Sale, and he needed some round bell hay and called me up, knew I was wanting to breed some good stock. And we made a trade that night, and I traded 16 round bells of hay for him. I love this Colt's origin story. Anytime a breeder can capture magic like that in an unlikely cross, it's, it's pretty special, right? I mean, here's a Colt that was sired by a random silver dollar stud that was sold at a public auction and later traded for some bales of hay. And one of the first Colts he has just turns out to be a freak. It's pretty awesome. And then this Colt gets paired with this young, up-and-coming third-generation trainer uh, from this upstart operation premiere. Lake and Rocky just kind of took right on off. I mean, they just kind of just matched up, you know, like it was meant to be, you know. And those guys go on to win a reserve world championship last year at the celebration in the two-year-old division class. And that's a pretty awesome story for such humble beginnings. So he's, he's kind of the scrappy underdog. He's in there competing against champion bred Colts. He's, he's not only competing, he's winning, and he just keeps getting better. 